Hey guys, uh, hey Wolfpack, just want to do a quick video on the BMS uh, Pilot Legs Mod, including the board. Uh, this came out October 24th, and it's made by PL Harpoon. Uh, it's just a, an awesome mod, basically that's what it looks like. And it adds pilot legs, there's also a pilot body, and um, a couple of knee boards here that you can customize which data goes on here. So this is a quick tutorial on how to set things up. And uh, Harpoon, I hope you don't mind, I, uh, I did upload it on Mediafire, and uh, I'll give you guys a link for that. If you want me to take it down, just let me know. I'll do that uh, immediately. Um, but, you know, in your README, it just said, you know, you can modify this. So I assume redistributing it is fine as well. Paul B. Harpoon, uh, thanks a lot for creating this. And uh, basically, uh, here's the Mediafire link. I'll I'll put that on our uh, DCS Wolfpack form underneath Falcon 4.0 BMS, Falcon 4.0 BMS initial setup and tutorials. And um, it'll it'll be called like the uh, BMS Virtual Pilot Korea Map Kneeboard. So this is what it looks like. The modified version has a map of Korea, which is, if you're familiar with sectionals in the aviation world, that's what they look like. Um, I, you can't see the details in this picture, but it's extremely detailed. Like you can zoom in all the way with my track IR. I have it on zoom and it has like tons of details, uh, including the terrain. It's got frequencies, ILS frequencies, TACCAN, the name of the airport. Um, it's got MO, um, Military operating areas, MOAs, which are you know true to real life, and then it's also got these uh, frequency chart again, uh, TACAN, ILS, and uh, whatever. It's awesome for on-the-fly navigation. You know, if you we had to divert like tonight's mission, you look up where we are in the uh, military operating area, look up an airport, find TACAN, fly to it. So it's it's really awesome. Anyway, so let's get down to it. Um, first thing you want to do is download the link, obviously. And the one that I provide on Mediafire is, is a modified version. It comes with uh, with the Korea map, which is 8019 8, DDS. Okay, so let's go ahead and open up the README, open up the zip file with me. And here's the README, and here's the uh, modified instructions. So they are a, a little bit different because some things have changed since he released it in 2011. All right, so the first thing you want to do is um, let's go ahead and go to our, our main uh, Falcon BMS folder. Uh, and what I did was just unzip these two folders in here. You got the LOD editor, which is a program we'll be using, as well as the actual modification files. Okay, so uh, let's look at the readme. And step one is, um, it says create a backup of this entire folder. And it's a huge file, so I didn't do that. You know, not, nothing broke, but you know, if, if you feel you need to do that, go ahead and, and do that. Uh, number two, put 8018.dds and 8019.dds in your BMS data, terrain data, objects, Korea object folder. Um, so what it looks like is um, uh, data, you go to terrain data, Korea, uh, let's see, terrain data, I'm sorry, objects, Korea objects, and has all these DDS files. Well, it's not going to replace anything. That 8018 and 8019, they're standalone files. So just go ahead and put them in there, and you're good to go. That's the first step. Okay, back up to the main thing. And then um, you want to open up your LOD editor. So open up LOD editor, click on this yellow icon here, LOD editor, and click on this Korea objects HDR. I know I'm going fast, but I've got a limited amount of time. Once you do that, um, let's follow the directions here. You want to, and it's very, you just want to be very careful. So if you need to rewind, really pay attention. I don't want you to screw something up or change the texture you're, you're not supposed to. Enter number two in the box here. And it took me a long time to figure this out. So you, you hit number two, you actually hit this box normal. It'll bring up another uh, uh, menu here. Click on uh, normal and then one under edit. So under um, here, you want to click one. Okay, and then you want to click select LOD, and here's where you want to put 82. So just go ahead, if it's different, just type in 82. Okay, click OK. Then you then you want to go up to uh, uh, action, append and replace texture. Okay, and that's where you want to select 8018. Click open, it says 8018 has been replaced. Then you want to um, do the same thing again. Append slash replace texture. Go to 8019, click open, texture 8019 has been replaced. Click OK, you're done with that. Then go to action, replace model. 
Okay. Before I do that, um, yeah, actually, I'll just go ahead and do that. Uh, replace model. And then this is where you want to select um, inside this BMS pilot model updated. It depends on what you want. Okay, the full pilot includes a uh, a mask and a body. You cannot see the side consoles very easily, but even with track IR, it's very, very difficult and cumbersome to do that. So I highly, 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 highly recommend only legs. That just gives you the leg portion with the knee boards, and um, that's all you need. Because you, if you can't get switches in flight and it makes it difficult, it, it's not worth it. I tried it with Pilot for, for for a while. It just it wasn't it wasn't great. So only legs LD, um, and then you click open. And then it says the length of this LD is greater than the original. Yeah, I want to continue. Do that. Okay, and then and then that's it. The, the changes you've changed the LED. Now go to and then go back to CT records. That's the main uh, uh, menu. So we're back to where we started right here. If you remember this screen, um, then you want to go just. Don't change anything. This should be on two already. Click 3D viewer. Okay. If you get a weird error, okay, you might get this weird cannot display 3D blah 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 blah. And then it's going to be looking for an executable file. Dot exe. Go into LOD editor, and then click on this OGL LOD dot exe. That's what it's looking for. Once you once you uh, do that, it'll open up this thing and it'll show you the uh, legs. Okay. And then it'll show you the um, the you should see the career map on here. It's low resolution, but that, it looks high resolution in the game. It was just far away. And then the other uh, chart here. Now, I'm going to stress that if you do not see legs and the career map and this thing here, you did something wrong. So, um, you know, I I kind of played with it. I made some mistakes. I maybe didn't follow steps. And I've done this like probably ten times already um, with different different things and. It's not going to seriously, that I found, it's, it didn't really mess anything up, like even if I made mistakes. So um, just make sure you follow the directions very, very, very carefully. And then, um, you know, once you do that, go in game and see if it worked. If it didn't work, um, it means something wrong happened. And if you follow this tutorial to the T and it still doesn't work, please let me know in the comments on YouTube. Um, again, this is what it looks like. And it's awesome. I, I highly recommend it. Again, thank you for Harpoon for making this awesome mod. It's invaluable in my opinion. I mean, as a real pilot, you know, like I can strap a kneeboard on and throw this, uh, <laughs> throw a map on there and print this out, I guess. But when you can do it with Track IR and actually look down and get vital information quickly, it's invaluable. So, hope you guys enjoy that. We are doing BMS at uh, DCS Wolfpack. So again. Any of the viewers, if you guys are interested in, in uh, doing this, we, we operate uh, Sundays at 2100. Uh, and, you know, just submit an application and we'll, ha we'll be happy to have you on board. You don't have to know everything. We're literally just starting BMS from scratch right now, so we're all learning together. And we come from other sims like FSX and um, DCS, so we're all learning this together. All right, guys. God bless. Peace out. Burn around.